ladies, welcome back to my channel. She is chic. I am Kassan. So today I got a really fun, exciting video. Um, we're going to get into some shapewear. Why? Because shapewear is really important especially for me because i be trying to get it snatched honey but anyway so i reached out to the company i don't know if you guys can see this sorry shaper mint now i'm gonna be 100 percent honest um i have not opened up this product at all whatsoever but one thing i will say when she emailed me back she said be 100 percent honest i will even show y'all the email she said be 100 percent honest like just tell us what you think of this product and i haven't opened this product i haven't seen it yet but i got about four different things and um what i will say out of all the shapewear that i've seen this has to be the most affordable i've spent upwards to 80 to 90 dollars on shapewear before so i'm hoping i'm praying dear baby jesus because this is so affordable i think the the most expensive thing i got in this bag was probably like 45 dollars. and anybody that frequently buys shapewear knows that 45 dollars is pretty reasonable for some some good shapewear so i'm praying that this works out so let's get into this initial reaction you guys all right so i am so excited i i love opening up packages it's like christmas day to me so the first thing i got a lot of stuff i got like four items so the first thing they sent was like a 20 percent off little coupon code you know just saying thanks for shopping with us i love when people send me coupons in the mail because i'm a saver and so the first thing i'm going to try on is like these biker shorts i know y'all can't really see that picture i'm sorry but they're like um they are called the high waist briefs but this is what they look like just your general and the size that i have is an extra large i bought me an extra large okay ladies I like this one as well. Uh, this is the high waist briefer, I mean briefer, brief shorts. They do suck me in pretty well. I will say they are not as comfortable as the shaper panties. Um, ho however, they do their job. And even though they have seams in them right here, I actually can't see the seams and but however i do have a panty line that you can kind of see but in the panty shorts the uh the shaper panties you don't see the seam line so these i think will be good under maybe like a, a jumpsuit or a play suit uh especially because with the material that i have on i have on like a jersey knit type stretchy dress and i don't like the fact that you can see my panty line i don't know how well that's showing up on camera but i can definitely see my panty line um i like them they suck me in and give me a nice shape but i definitely like the panty briefs better i thought i had got the leggings y'all but i guess i didn't it's okay um because they had some leggings i'll probably just buy those and try those on myself but these are um high waist panties uh shaper panties they almost like the um high waist briefs that i got but they're the shaper panties um these actually don't have seams in them which is pretty cool so when you put on your shapewear you won't have to deal with the seams so i like that a lot because i hate when i put on a, a tight fitted dress and you can see the seam of my dang on shapewear like I'm supposed to be pretending to be, you know, J-Lo. And you letting everybody know that my J-Lo is flawed and not real. So I don't like that. I don't like that at all. So the fact that I don't have to deal with seams in this shapewear, got to love it. So one thing I will say that I always see them advertise on um, their social media is that these do not ride down and i'm assuming it's because of this these groove like 
uh, rubbery things in here to help them stay on the waist instead of riding down because every woman knows the biggest heartache or the biggest headache of having on shapewear when you got on a briefs is the freaking rubber just don't work sis it just don't work okay you guys i'm really being a trooper because i'm about to show you guys my insecurity which is my belly but this is the shaper panty Woo. and just like i suspected i probably could have went down a size but look Oh, that makes a difference. Honey, do not play with her. Oh, that makes a huge difference. I promise y'all, I am not sucking it in. Like, and I'm gonna come closer because this is the shaper panty, which means you don't get the seams. So, that made a huge difference. And I actually look pretty slender. All right, ladies. So, the next thing I have is the Body Ultra Slim. Um, it is like a pretty much like a bodysuit. And it's like the briefs. And, ooh, you know what? I like the fact that it snaps and unsnaps because... What I hate doing when I go to the bathroom, when I got on a full body suit, um, shapewear, I feel like I got to get completely naked. And it's so like, it's just, it just make me feel naked and uncomfortable in a public restroom when I got to go out and I just got to take off everything. Um, again, it has, it got some stretch to it, but I can definitely tell it's going to suck everything in because... Honey, this thing is super tight. And I got this in a size extra large. Um, when you are buying shapewear, you do want to kind of go down a size because the point of shapewear is to suck it all in. So I always go down a size because I'm pretty sure I probably could have fit a 2X. But the whole point of shapewear is to snatch it to the guys, honey. You want everything to be snatched in, snitched in. You don't want no lumps, bumps, nothing. So I got me an extra large so that we can suck everything in. So I'm look, I'm actually really looking forward to this because I love wearing bodysuits under my dresses because I don't like I don't want to feel like I'm gonna tug it at all freaking night. And yeah, so we'll see. Okay, I am so sad, but this bodysuit did not work out for me. Um I'm just like a size too big. I needed a size bigger, but this bodysuit is, I got an extra large and that's the largest that it comes in on the site, which makes me so sad. I need to lose about 20 more pounds to get in this body. It's crazy. I need to lose weight to get in some shapewear. But anyway, I need to lose about 20 more pounds before I can get into shapewear. And I would show y'all me struggling trying to get into it, but I was like half naked. <laughs> No, I was pretty much naked trying to get into the. All I had on was my bra trying to get into this bodysuit. But it didn't work out, um, which is sad because I'm pretty sure if I would have been able to get into this, honey, my body would have been. Let me tell y'all something. The curves that would have been popping in this body, in this bodysuit. So give me about 20 more pounds. I'm going to be in there. I ain't, it ain't going nowhere. It's going to stay right there in that drawer until I lose these extra 20 pounds. But let's get to the next one, y'all. All right, so the next thing I got is the high waist shaper shorts. So the difference between the shorts and the brief, of course, uh, with the shorts, I could wear these with like a, again, I got these in an extra large as well. This one actually is an extra large and an XXL. Uh, this may be too big for me we'll see anyway uh the difference between these and the briefs of course the briefs only stop at your butt with the shorts they're going to help shape them thighs too so if you have on like a jumpsuit or a bodysuit or whatever like that 
This will help keep them thighs in place because my thighs like to jiggle. Ain't nothing wrong with a little jiggle, but sometimes you want it to be tamed. I don't want my jelly to be jiggling everywhere all the time. So anyway, so these shorts are going to help tame that jelly. So, and you can even honestly probably wear this under some leggings. So, you know how like when you wear your leggings, I'm the type of person, this is probably going to be TMI, but I like to free ball, free, free ball under my leggings. I don't, no, it's just too much because the penny line end up showing anyway. So, you might as well free ball. And if you put on a thong, it's going to jiggle anyway. So, whatever. But anyway, if you don't want a free ball and you want to tighten it up, you can put these bad boys under some leggings. Um, again, I think these might be too tight. I think these might be a little too... I mean, not too tight, but too big. But we'll see. We'll see how they work. We'll put them to the test. All right, so right now I have on these shaper shorts. And I like them. They're really comfortable. They're tucking everything in like they're supposed to do. Um, I'm shaking my legs right now and they're not jiggling. There's everything is staying in place. These shaper shorts will be perfect to put like under a jumpsuit or a long maxi dress or a long maxi skirt, whatever you choose to do. But I like them. I actually probably could have went down a size in these right now. I have on an extra large slash 2X, which is probably a little too big for me. Um, I'm still getting used to my smaller body and I haven't realized or took into a realization that I'm smaller than what I used to be. So I'm used to ordering larger sizes, but I probably could have went down to a medium slash large in these shorts. Cause, but even though that they're fitting a little bigger, they're supposed to be a little more snug, but even though they're not as snug as they should be or could be, they're still pulling and tucking everything in. So I'm okay with that. Um, right now, I'm currently like a size 14, 16. So, yeah, I probably could have went down to a medium slash large in these. All right, ladies, that is pretty much it. I don't have a lot of negative comments to say, really. Besides the bodysuit, everything else fit lovely. It was perfect. Um, I just need to lose about 20 more pounds before I can get into this bodysuit. But I'm going to get there. <laughs> anyway, um, the extra large was the largest that the bodysuit came in. So... There's nothing that I can do to possibly replace it. Um, other than that, for the shapewear to be a fraction of the cost of shapewear that you get from like Macy's, Torrid, Lane Bryant, all that good stuff, everything that I got was between $25 to $45. And for me to get the same results or even better, I think that that is a win. Um, the only negative comment that I probably have is that I wish that their nude um, shapewear was more uh, friendly to women of color. Uh, they're not the only company that don't really cater to us, but it'll be nice to get some some new shapewear that will complement my skin tone and it actually be nice to put on me. <laughs> Uh, but that's just not just only shapewear. That's undergarments, period. Most women of color are not able to wear nude shapewear because the color just doesn't usually fit us. So um, that's my only negative comment that I possibly have. But other than that, I will leave the links down below of everything that I got. Um, ladies, don't forget to like, comment, share, and mostly subscribe, 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 subscribe. Um, also, if you want to know where I got this big, luscious hair from, <laughs> I'm going to leave the card at the top. I did a review over this hair. I love this hair. This is like my favorite wig, my go-to wig. Um, but that link will be at the top. So, ladies, it's been trill. I ain't heard that word in a long time. <laughs> but anyway, thanks, ladies, for watching the video. Y'all have a good night or day, whatever. Who knows?